Welcome back guys, my name is Alm and today I'm looking at the band Why Don't We and their video Eight Letters. Where you can see paper objects around the singer. This effect has been seen in movies and music videos like, like Alex Sun's Shining Video. They film this in a church but you can film this anywhere. However, if you film indoors you'll have more control over lighting. But that's uh, another video. Film your shot. You'll also need to take a shot of the paper because we're going to duplicate this a thousand times. As I'm on my own, I'm using the dancing man on a green screen plate from a previous film on a church background. Fire up After Effects and let's start the composition. Since we want the paper to move around us, we need to duplicate the clip of these transitions. From here, select the top click and go to the toolbox. Click on the pen tool and make a mask around your subject. You'll be adjusting the mask to follow the subjects. Don't forget to animate the mask path in the properties. Finally, increase the feather a bunch. Now we can start creating a storm of things. In the effects library, search for the particle world effect and drag and drop it onto the top clip. You'll see it automatically generates particles, but these are ones we don't want. Fry and drag the tip of the paper. If it's a video of the image, once this is done, we can disable the paper layer and click on the top layer to access the particles layer. From here, change the particle type to text quad polygon. This will allow me to access the paper layers in the text tab and the second drop down change to effects and masks. Okay, now we're getting closer, but I need to make it go around the subject. To do this, open the physics tab and change the animation viscosis. Viscosis? Visco viscosis? However you say it, currently the particles are going from the top down, so we'll need to change the following settings. Change both gravity and velocity to zero, but now all the particles are all together. To fix this, open the producer tab. From here, open up the axes X, Y and Z to fill the room. Now we have the position, I want to adjust the paper itself. Open the particles tab and increase the rotation a bunch and change the bird and depth size to what you're looking for. Finally, set the opacity to 100%. Next, go to the birth rate and change it to how fast you want the paper to appear and the longevity of how long you want the paper to last. The last thing to do, I promise, open the extra tab, click on composition with original. This makes the person become part of the 3D space. Using the effects camera tab, you can align the paper with the original camera or place it behind the person. From here, I'll need to keyframe the Y axis to make the paper move around the subject. Next, open the depth cube and change the type to fade. Change the distance value and make the background softer, having them out of focus. Open the light direction and move the virtual light on its axis, allowing you to match the light in the shot. It looks good, but we're missing some motion blur. Just go down to the composition and click on motion blur on the layer and here on the comp. And those are all the settings and you're done. Thank you so much for the support of the last few weeks guys. I'm up to 99 subscribers.